Tia Marie, the host of cooking channels Tia Marie at Home, has been a public figure for over two decades. She first gained fame as a teenager when she starred alongside her twin sister and a popular comedy sister sister. For her outstanding work on the show, Tia received two NAACP Image Award for Outstanding Actress in a comedy series and three Guest Choice Awards for Favorite Television Actress. Following the conclusion of the series, Tia pursued higher education and obtained a bachelor's degree in psychology from Pepperdine University. Tia is also a published author, having released her debut book in 2013, titled "Old Baby: Pregnancy Tales and Advice from One Hot Mama to Another." Tia Marie was transparent in her social media posts about her journey with reproductive health. The sister sister star encouraged people to share their own experiences about their own fertility issues by being open about her efforts to conceive. I'm so grateful every day that Cree and Carol enter our life," stated Mary on Instagram after getting married to her husband Cory Hardwick in 2008. My endometriosis made pregnancies difficult for me. I wasn't even sure I could get there. I was so scared when I first heard my diagnosis, thinking I might not be able to have kids. The woman admitted. And I am aware that I'm not the only person who has traveled the same path. She learned from her fans that she was not the only person dealing with endometriosis. Some women, like as a follower, remarked that her remarks came at the perfect moment. Needed this, she said. The management of endometriosis is challenging. Another person said, "I'm hoping for a miracle for myself because it hasn't been easy." I learned that having endo doesn't necessarily mean that a person's dreams of having a child won't come true," she wrote in the caption. My beautiful children came after making dietary changes, concentrating on my health, and a lot of prayers," she said. As stated by John Hopkins Medicine, endometriosis is a common gynecological condition affecting an estimated two to ten percent of American women of childbearing age. If a woman doesn't become pregnant, this tissue accumulates during her typical menstrual cycle and is lost. Endometriosis patients develop tissues outside of the uterus that resembles and behaves like endometrial tissues, typically on other reproductive organs in the pelvic or the abdominal cavity. This misplaced tissue builds up and breaks down each month in response to the hormonal changes of the menstrual cycle, much like the endometrium does, causing minute bleeding inside the pelvis. The normal tissues surrounding the endometriosis implants become inflamed, swollen, and scarred as a result, according to the medical research website. In recognition of National Endometriosis Awareness Month, which is observed in March, Marie published the article. At the end of her article, she addressed others out there with endometriosis. I see you and send you love, strength, encouragement, and healing. Tell us what you think of Tia Marie's story. Please leave your comments in the comment column to let us know. Subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications to receive the latest on Tia Marie. Thank you for watching the whole video.